Hi, I'm Sai. I go to Lee High School. I'm going to be a junior this year. My project is the gesture controlled car, and this is my actual final milestone. So this is likely going to be my last milestone video. I don't think I'll make any other changes to my gesture controlled car. Uh, the changes that I've made for this milestone is that first I've um, replaced this wheel with a new wheel because uh, the wheel that I had before it was a bit loose because it had like a plastic deformity in, in the inside so it wouldn't like properly fit all the way into like the shaft of the motor and that would cause it that would cause the wheel to like pop off d while it's running and that that's a pretty big problem secondly um i added a switch to the car if i click if i press the switch everything turns on and if i turn it off everything turns off and I added a switch because before I had um, these tiny pins from the wires that I had to attach to like these female adapter wires for the for the car. And those pins were like very loose. And while the car is up and running um, and it's driving, uh, the wires would get loose and they would come out of the female adapter. And that would um, cause the car to stop. So I, I soldered everything and I made it so that it's actually stable and no problems could occur and lastly i decided to use this 1.5 volt battery holder there are six 1.5 volt batteries in here so in total there's um nine volts and i decided to use this because the nine volt battery uh doesn't last too long with my car i would have to replace it like every every few days and that's too expensive so i bought these rechargeable 1.5 volt batteries and um additionally um these 1.5 volt batteries they had they send in more amps of current so it actually makes the car much faster than before now it's actually able to run perfectly on carpet without any issues before it would only run correctly on um on a flat stone or wooden surface but now it, it works perfectly on all surfaces and it's much faster as well and yeah, uh, next up I'll show you a demo of my car. So as you can see, when I keep my hand uh, straight and when I don't tilt my hand anywhere, uh, the, the car stays. When I tilt it forward, it goes forwards. When I tilt it backwards, it goes backwards, forwards, backwards, forwards, backwards. When I tilt it side to side, the car goes side to side. And that's basically how it turns. And yep, that's it. As you can see, it also got faster um, because I added a more powerful battery pack. I replaced the 9-volt battery pack with these 1.5-volt batteries. And yeah, that's basically it.